My name is Cassandra Coppy. I am the Learning Assistance Program Teacher at Deer Park Middle School. Jeffrey Dunn, Secondary Learning Assistance Program Coordinator, Deer Park Middle School. The students in my class are anywhere from one to four grade levels below in reading and or writing. Due to that, a lot of the students that are in my classes say, you know, I don't like reading or even I can't read because they've never really been good at it. So we needed to break down that barrier and that preconceived notion that they couldn't be good readers. Flex Literacy has been extremely effective in my classroom. I have seen some of the most significant improvements in Lexile levels that I've ever seen throughout my teaching career. Um, we've seen two grade levels growth, and that's right out of the chute. That's without anybody actually you know, coming in and doing a lot of instruction, having a lot of practice. My students have been really, really proud of the improvements that they've made over the year. And when we go to take these assessments and get their new scores, they call us over and they're like, hey, Miss Copy, look at this. Look at how much I improved. For me, I'd say the digital because it's it basically is my pace, so I can go as fast or as slow as I want or need. Um, learning new things and like, since my Lexile score was low, it helped me bump it up. It's helped me on like how my reading level's gone up and my writing level's gone up. You get to play games, you get to hear music while you're doing it, and learn. On the digital component, it's one-on-one -on -one instruction. So the engagement has been there the whole time. They're receiving new skills, they're listening, they're reading, and so they're working well on that. In our print experience, we're working in small groups, and that's really been able to give me more one-on-one -on -one time with my students, and they've really enjoyed that. We're always in conversation. We're talking about the text. In the project experience, students have a lot of choice so they've really been interested in what they're doing. And they get to work together. So anytime that I can put them in groups, they're excited to do it and they're going to be engaged. Two of the really key pieces that I'm able to find on my report section on the digital experience are the Lexile progress and the fluency progress. So from the beginning of the year, I can see where my students are and how much they're gaining. The data also helps us with learning assistance program reporting. The state requires that we track student growth to be able to show progress and to show that we're spending state money wisely. So the numbers don't lie. They have made significant improvements in Lexile. They've made significant improvements in fluency. And that has given them the courage to be better readers and the pride to be better readers that has really changed our classroom setting. My perception of McGraw-Hill definitely has changed. The world that I came from was McGraw-Hill was a textbook company. They're incorporating technology so that when I give my students these tools, they're able to go out into the real world and use those exact same tools and succeed there as well. They have moved with the change in the times that they've moved into the digital world. They've worked with some very, very important educators to construct this program. I know what to do now. I know how to help students read. I know how to engage students in the text. I know how to interact with them to get them to that love of reading that we all want our students to be at. 